Prime View TV. New media with a difference. show i'm your host miss stella king and you're watching us on prime view television remember you can always catch us every saturday by 9 p.m but from next week it will be on sundays 11 a.m so make sure you watch out for the stella king show on prime view television and remember you can always follow me on facebook at stella king at the stella king show or on instagram the stella king show and my email address if you want to contact me is stella king show at email.com now this week guys i had an amazing week i was at the london cabaret and i was with some amazing people and i had an exclusive interview which i'm shortly going to show you all and it was just fantastic the music the atmosphere it was just radiant it was spectacular you guys should have been there but don't worry you'll get to see some of it and you also get to see this interview i had so before we go i just want to remind you that last week we had a competition that people had to follow share and tag me so when we come back we'll be doing that the competition for you guys Remember, it was a hundred pounds, so let's see when we get back. Welcome to the Stella King Show. I'm your host, Miss Stella King, and I'm at Central London at an amazing event at the London Cabaret with RJ Gibb, who is the son of Robin Gibbs of the Bee Gees. Hello, how are you today? How are you? I'm great, and I'm also with an amazing individual called Andrew Eborn. Oh. Hello, how Hello. are you? I'm not really described as an amazing <laughs> Well, because you are amazing. I thought I was for Larry King. <laughs> Larry King. You know, what is this, Stanley? Yeah, what? Well, <laughs> <laughs> it's great to have you guys on the show today. Thank you. Um, I'm here today at their amazing event, which is called KTT. It's presented by KTT, isn't it? Right. Now, can you tell me exactly what KTT is all about and what it stands for? Well, KTT uh, stands for Not the Truth, and uh, it was uh, I forged the company alongside my good friend, uh, Mr. Andrew Eborn, and um, it's it's an entertainment company that deals with. Uh, we have a record company, KTT Records, as well as. Uh, dealing with live performances, live shows, and we've got a new show, of course, we're putting on today that has to do with introducing new hot up-and-coming acts to the, to the music industry. Okay. Before you continue, okay, you said not the truth, yes. not the truth. Not the truth yes. So some people think it's not the truth. <laughs> well, it, it comes about because, of course, we forged the company when we were originally dealing with um, ideas for, for shows that deal with uh, the, the fake news era. And we, okay. And, uh, and well, what is now called fake news, and of course it's, it's been around since uh, dawn of man, it's propaganda. Okay. And we've been uh, involved with, because we're both magicians as well, well I'm, I'm a mentalist and he's a, he's a magician, we, we've both been involved. Uh, a mentalist and a magician? magician yes. Oh wow. We do the magic circle. And magic so, circle? Yeah, yeah. So I thought you were going to draw a square then. <laughs> A magic circle. I'm a bit like, oh! Really if you're not sure what a circle is, thank you, Stella. That's brilliant. I love it. <laughs> but you want, yeah, yeah. Oh, we've got triangles as well. Um, what, what I love about it, and RJ's absolutely right, the mm -hmm. whole thing about the media at the moment, it's all about question everything. 
And so what we're doing, we're doing a number of shows. We have TV shows, we have feature films, we have uh, books, we have all sorts of exciting things. Um, but that, one of the premises is about question everything, because we're, we're growing up in an age where we're inundated with material. Oh, that's lots, actually, absolutely lots true. Yes. And the reality is, most of it is rubbish. Mm -hmm. It's always got an angle they're trying to push. Yes. So what we're trying to encourage everybody is to just think about things, question everything. Okay. And so one of our series is looking at some of the things we've always assumed to be true over the years and saying, okay, did this really happen? And yes. Is, we can so, more so how do you present that through music? Like, for instance, today, this event you're doing, how do you portray not, not the truth? How do you present this truth? So, oh, well, really or this question, so, yes, I, I want to know. Giving, we're giving a platform to artists who truly deserve it. Okay. That's, that's the thing. Yeah. I mean, there is a, a paradigm at the moment in, in the industry that, uh, that, that deals with um, people they think, well, they, they, they deal with um, s things they think should be that way. You know, like they, they, they think it is a, a sequence that works. But really, um, it's it's all down to does the person sound good? Do, you know, it, there's no such thing as right or wrong uh, type of music. It's, oh well, it's, I'm it's actually impressed. That's what people like. That's actually what we do need out here. You do see that there are a lot of talent out there, yeah. but because they they're not recognized. yeah they're not recognised like you've just rightly said. And there's something also they seem like okay, is this really what's in yeah. right now? So, I actually like the thing where you question things, yeah. you know. I well, you're questioning, well, the interesting thing, Stella, is you're questioning the dynamic of the music industry. In this mm, yes. So what happens is the traditional way you would launch an artist mm -hmm. is you maybe make a television appearance promoting a record, they then go out live and so on and so forth, but you are dependent on the established record labels, which are brilliant, really, really brilliant. Nowadays, it's more difficult, if you like, to find new talent. People are becoming less and less adventurous, if you like, and do that sort of stuff. Yes. So what RJ and I said, we will help give a platform for new talent. Uh, we have KTT Records, which is a beautiful logo, which uh, RJ is wonderfully creative on that sort of side as well. And what we do is basically give new talent a platform. So tonight, RJ is working with lots of new talent as well. We've got some special guests, very special guests. Some of them are big celebrities. And some looking of them forward to it. as well know. Okay. And that's what's happening. RJ's giving them Oh, so you're bringing them all together into one network. Oh, that's a brilliant idea. That's amazing. Yes. And also, early on speaking to you, RJ and Andrew, um, you talked about charity, how KTT is involved in charity work. What, what type of charity work? Well, we've had uh, quite, quite a... Uh, a wide range, um, of course, from uh, everything to do with um, uh, from mental health to, to uh, general health and, and uh, cancer research, as well as um, Alzheimer's. We're also dealing. Uh, we've dealt with the, um, the the Lifeboat Association as well as uh, the Air Ambulance um, uh, groups. So, yeah, we it, we we try to to help in any way we can in, in society. Yeah, I think that's a brilliant thing you're both doing and I can't wait for the show today. I'm looking forward to it, to the meeting the celebrities and upcoming, new upcoming artists and I'm sure it's going to be a great event. It's going to be a fantastic event and this is just the preview. I was going to actually ask you, is this the first of its kind? Yeah, absolutely. So what's going to happen is, is RJ is on a regular basis, it's going to be doing exactly that, performing uh, some of his own songs, some of his uncle's songs, some of his father's songs, but also giving that platform for as well. Yes. So today we have a special industry launch, so the great, the good and the unwashed from the music industry as well as other media are here. Uh, and what's going to then happen is we're going to do a whole series of these concerts going out. Okay, that's brilliant. Thank you so much. Thank you, Andrew. And thank you so much, RJ, for coming on the show. Great to see you. Great to see you. <laughs> okay, guys, so you've heard it here. I'm looking forward to this event and we're going to show you clips and snippets of it. Thank you. <laughs> I'm here with a beautiful, exquisite individual. 
who goes by the name Sarah Serenity Project as she likes to be called. Hello. Hi. <laughs> it's great to see you here. Too. Oh my god, amazing. Oh, Pleasure. yeah, it is. So, what are you expecting from this event? I mean, it's nice to hear music, different types of versatile styles. I myself am into music. Um, and so, I feel like music is all about emotion, and you know, music itself means to think. And so, for me personally, it's going to be a thing of because they're an independent label, it'll be nice to hear what kind of music they're putting forward and um, yeah it's nice to be different I like different. and so yeah I'm just glad to be here tonight and looking forward I know now you're into music like you just rightly said so what kind of music um, what kind of genre are you normally into genre um, for me personally with genres I I don't really in, in a sense believe in the word genre because I, I believe music again is versatile mm -hmm. I feel music because it causes people to think it's deeper than just you know a sound music. that's exactly what KTT actually stands for you know not the truth so their idea is to bring up music in a different way in, yeah. in a different versatile way should I say and because so many people have stuck to this ideology that oh because it doesn't sound this way, it doesn't sound that way, oh we can't listen to it. Mm -hmm. And also because the media has a lot of impact and affects the music we listen to. So what KTT is actually trying to do is bring out new upcoming artists who do have a different unique sound, something different, and bring them together with other people and other celebrities and make something new yeah. so um yeah so continue what do you think about that i think that's amazing we need something like that in the marketplace we need something that's different it's distinct it's um unique and especially for people to express their different sounds i believe sound go be goes beyond just people there's different types of linguas and tribes and languages and um, it's so important that we perpetrate that in the mm -hmm. media and people see much more of it. And so, yeah, I mean, it's something I'm very keen on. Do you mind singing a bit for us? Sing. <laughs> <laughs> At least give us a bit, please. <laughs> I've heard it before, please. <laughs> <laughs> that would be in another show. Oh, another show. <laughs> okay, guys. <laughs> Thank you so much. Thank, Thank you. you. Thank you, Sarah. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Welcome back guys, wasn't that a great interview? Oh my god, I was just so excited and happy. That interview was amazing and also the atmosphere and the music. Oh my god, bringing different people together, unity, is what I loved about it. The whole show, you saw elderly people, you saw young people, you saw people from different backgrounds come together, which I thought was phenomenal. And you know, that's what RJ, who's the son of Robin Gibb, of the Bee Gees, was talking to me about this is what they're trying to bring out unity bring out real music true music like give everybody out there a chance and you know what amazed me was the name ktt not the truth you know the idea of what they said about the media bringing out fake news how music can influence you in certain ways and you know and how music is very important the way it, it is portrayed so i think it's fantastic what rj and andrew eborn are doing um kudos to you guys i think it's fabulous and i think you guys should keep on doing it because i know you guys will be watching this yes so guys well done now for the viewers out there so like i said last week we had a competition and it was whoever wins will get a hundred pounds are you guys ready because I'm ready. Okay, let's start. And remember, this is once a month. So next month, you have a chance to be a winner. Are okay, you ready? Okay, let's show you. Oopsie, okay. And the name is Mattia Esposito. Mattia Esposito, well done. You won the 100 pounds, so we'll be contacting you very soon okay guys thanks for watching and i'll see you next week remember it's going to be sundays 11 a.m on prime view television don't forget the stella king show and don't forget to follow and share all our shows thank you bye yeah
Prime View TV. New media with a difference.